reading today is from Matthew, chapter 16, verses 13 to 16. Now when Jesus came into the district of Caesarea Philippi, he asked his disciples, Who do people say that the Son of Man is? And they said, Some say John the Baptist, but others Elijah, and others say Jeremiah, or one of the prophets. He said to them, But who do you say that I am? Simon Peter answered, You are the Messiah, the Son of the living God. Caesarea Philippi, where this incident took place, was a Roman city located at the southwestern base of Mount Hermon. There was a cliff face, a spring, and seven pagan temples dedicated to Roman and Greek gods. One of them was the Greek god Pan, which means all or everything. We use that word in English today. Ever heard of the word pandemic? There was also a cave known as the Gates of Hades, where offerings were thrown in to appease the gods. Jesus asked the disciples, who do people say I am? They answered, some say John the Baptist, Elijah, Jeremiah, or another prophet. He pushed them further, who do you say I am? Peter answered that he, Jesus, was the Messiah, the Son of the living God. We all have to make a personal response to this supreme question, who is Jesus? Tourists visit Caesarea Philippi today as it is an archeological site. Those Roman and Greek temples have long since disappeared. The cave is still there. It would have seemed inconceivable at that time that these temples would be gone in a few years and that the claims of an itinerant preacher who was not backed by state or religious leaders would triumph. However, today, throughout the world, millions of people acknowledge Jesus as King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Count me in. He is our personal saviour. Peter made mistakes. If he'd been on that show, The Apprentice, he would have heard those words, you're fired. But Jesus never gave up on him. And all of us who acknowledge Jesus as our personal saviour, like Peter, will be kept by his love. Sometimes we feel we are hanging on by a thread. But as someone once told me, if you're hanging on by a thread, make sure that thread is attached to the hem of his garment. We stumble and fall, but Jesus says, I will never leave you or forsake you. If we belong to him, we are God's child forever, and the gates of Hades will not prevail against us, because Jesus defeated all our enemies when he died and rose again. We are his sheep, and he being the good shepherd will never lose one. So let's pray. We thank you, Lord, we belong to you and you'll keep us safe and secure because of your love. We praise you because Jesus is the Messiah, the Son of the living God. Bless us and bless others through us. We ask it in the name above all names, the name of Jesus. Amen.